Hi everyone, moi kaikki, and welcome to my new second channel. So this will be my first video on here, and I will be starting off with, hopefully it's quite basic stuff, so I thought I would start off with how to pronounce the three extra letters that are in the Finnish alphabet that are different to that of the English alphabet, which are these three. So I will go through them one by one and we can learn them together. So the first one is what is called Ruotsalainen O, which means Swedish O. It is a vowel that was brought over from the Swedish language. Actually, you don't really see it at all in the Finnish language. It's more of in either some people's names that have derived from the Swedish language or, you know, because in Finland everything has to be in Finnish and in Swedish, so sometimes you'll see it in the Swedish translations of either city names or words, street names, stuff like that. So this one you don't have to be too worried about because honestly you won't stumble across it too often, but it's good to know. And how you pronounce it is basically kind of like just an O, as in like open, so it's just like O. Oh, oh. <laughs> For example, the Finnish city Turku in Swedish would be Obo, which is Swedish O B O, and it would just be pronounced Obo. Moving on to the next letter, it is called A, and this one I think is the most common out of the three, and it's very very common in Finnish, and it's also something that some people do have trouble pronouncing sometimes. And it's basically pronounced just as um, kind of like A in hat, hat, a. So what you want to do is just try to mimic that short A sound that you find in the word hat, hat, a, a. And that's basically it. So for example, the word for me in Finnish is mina, mina, mina. It has that a in the end and yeah, you can practice with that word, mina. Or for example, misa is where in Finnish. You can practice with that word too. Misa, misa, ah, ah. It also kind of sounds like when you get scared and you're like, ah, <laughs> you know, ah. <laughs> and then moving on to the last one is the uh. So this one is still fairly common in Finnish, not as common as ah is, but you still run into it quite often. So how you pronounce this one is uh. When I was kind of looking at how you would describe this to someone, a lot of people described it as like saying fur, bird, bird, fur, er, uh, uh, but I kind of, it just doesn't sound the same in my eyes. So for me, it would just be kind of, a, just try and imitate the sound. It's more like an uh, uh. It kind of sounds like a bit like throwing up or you're unsure of something like eh, 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 but it's more like uh, uh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I the only way that I can think of how to describe it in like an English way is I don't know if this is offensive or not. I honestly don't try to offend anyone, but it's at least in Finland I can hear when people try to imitate the British accent, for example, her, people would be they would try to drop the R, so it would be like her, her, and that ending, uh, is kind of what you try to imitate for uh itself. Huh, uh. And obviously I'm not trying to offend anyone that speaks, you know, in a British accent because obviously that is very exaggerated and overdone. But just to get the point across, I'm trying to come up with ideas of how to explain this. And I'm really sorry, really sorry about this. But yeah, that is basically how you would pronounce uh. So a lot of words that contain uh are usually y uh words, for example, le which is to hit, le, uh, le. It's a bit hard to pronounce, I guess, if you're just starting out. And things like su, to eat, su, e, uh, su, or u, uh, night, u, e, u. It can, I guess, be a little hard to pronounce at first, but if you just practice, you can kind of start getting used to how the mouth has to contort a bit to get the words out. That is the end of the video, so hopefully now you have a bit more of a grasp on how you can practice to learn how to pronounce O, A, and E. Uh. Yep! <laughs> Let me know what you want to learn next, leave it in the comments below, and that just about concludes this video. Till next time!